My name is Guranjan Grewal. I work as a medical oncologist at the Toowoomba Hospital. As we all know, cancer changes lives. It not only affects the people diagnosed with cancer, but their families and their loved ones. It was with the aim to help people with cancer that I specialized in medical oncology. Living and working in Toowoomba gives you a great work-life balance. Working with exceptional teams provides you a rewarding professional experience. In small communities, we make lasting friendships, enjoying a culture with a diverse group of people and a great outdoor lifestyle. Working in regional communities gives you more opportunities to grow as an individual as, and a professional. You have more opportunities to work individually and, and to provide leadership. In addition, working regionally, you have to work as a community oncologist, treating a whole lot of cancer types, whereas in tertiary hospitals, you, end, you are specializing and treating a few cancer subtypes. I came to Australia in 2005 with a job at the Toowoomba Hospital. I enjoyed working at Toowoomba. I was very well supported and found some, found exceptional mentors who helped me in my professional training. After completing my training in oncology, I was keen in getting back to Toowoomba because of the culture in the hospital and in the city. I had made some great friends long-lasting friendships, which brought me back to Toowoomba. Working with a group of highly skilled medical professional and healthcare teams and helping patients through their cancer journey is a very satisfying and a humbling experience. To become a medical oncologist, you need to apply for a fellowship to the Royal Australasian College of Physicians. Fellowship is a six-year full-time training pathway consisting of three years full-time basic training in adult internal medicine, followed by three years full-time advanced training in medical oncology. Adult internal medicine basic training consists of two years full-time core training, including three months general and acute care medicine and 12 months in medical specialities. Maximum one year non-core training. Completing basic training in adult internal medicine allows doctors to train in general and acute care medicine and or specialize in one of the 26 medical specialities available in the advanced training program. Advanced training in medical oncology consists of two years full-time core training and one year's full-time non-core training. Entry requirements include general registration with the Medical Board of Australia, be a citizen of Australia or New Zealand, or a permanent resident of Australia, have completed the RACP basic physician training, including the RACP written and clinical examinations, having an appointment to the appropriate advanced training position. In Queensland, the first year basic training position are recruited and managed directly by the individual hospital and health service, not via the network. RACP is not responsible for trainee recruitment. Information relating to the training positions in accredited hospitals to provide basic training is accessed via the available positions within each hospital via the Resident Medical Officer Campaign website. The Queensland Basic Physician Training Network provides centralized recruitment selection and allocation of basic physician trainees intending to commence their second and third year of training in Queensland and our registrar level appointments. New and current trainees need to apply for advanced training with RACP each year. To proceed to advanced training, applicants can secure an advanced training position at an accredited training site by applying through the Resident Medical Officer Campaign to the Queensland Medical Oncology Training Network. The network manages the recruitment, 
selection and allocation of new and continuing trainees to accredited training sites. Once you have secured a training position, you must prospectively apply for approval with the RACP as per the progression through training policy. My tips to prospective oncology trainees would be to do a oncology term during their basic adult medicine training program and in addition do an audit or a research project in oncology which will provide them mileage over the other trainees who are interested in oncology. The science and art of medical oncology is very rewarding and Tivumba offers a great work-life balance. I encourage trainees to choose medical oncology as a speciality.